first revolutionary armed force. April the twenty-fifth is the significant day when the first revolutionary armed force of the Tse type was founded in Korea. The great leader Kim Il Sung set out on the road of revolution in his early years, clarified the truth that the arms guaranteed the life of the nation and the victory of the revolution, and put forward the strategic policy on organizing and waging an anti-Japanese armed struggle. On its basis. He founded the Korean People's Revolutionary Army, the first revolutionary armed force of the Tse type, on the plateau at Tu Chidian in Xiao Shahe of Antu County on April the 25th, Tse 21 or at 1932. At that time, it was called the Anti-Japanese People's Guerrilla Army. As a result, the Korean people could have their genuine army for the first time in their history. On the day, the glorious history of the Korean Revolution, advancing with the might of the arms, started. The Korean People's Revolutionary Army was formed with workers, peasants, and patriotic youths hating the Japanese imperialists and loving the country and the people. That day, Kim Il Sung made a historic speech under the title, on the occasion of founding the anti-Japanese People's Guerrilla Army. In the speech, he said, "Korea, the golden tapestry of 3000 Ri, had now become a complete colony under the hoof of the Japanese imperialists, and ardently called for waging a vigorous armed struggle against them." The Korean People's Revolutionary Army defeated the Japanese imperialists in the long, bloody battles under the outstanding leadership of Kim Il Sung, and accomplished the historic course of national liberation.